Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 3 Part <laughs> 69. Aw, oh, yeah, anyways. I'm gonna buy a car. I'm in my, this Volvo for reasons, because I was checking out which car I should use. Unfortunately, I've already used that Volvo, so I gotta use something else, so... <laughs> that something else is gonna be the Saab 9.3 Turbo X. Because X means it's extreme. So yay, I'm back at 8,000 8, subs. Yay! I don't know. Anyways, this is mine now, and I'm going to do a quick upgrade to it just to get it to the top of, ooh, it's 275 is the top of E, yeah, whatever. Get it to the top of E class at least. Sure that works. And then, um... Wow, it didn't even get me remotely close to the top of E-Class. Fucking shitty-ass game. Alright, let's finish upgrading the tire width, I guess. Let's just sell these. Just to make a little money back. Suck me butt game. And let's put street t compound on there. Just for a little more grip. That should do. Hopefully. So, let's go race, and we get to go to the season play mode again. Ooh. But first I need to get into the, uh, the Volvo. That, that's what I need to do. So, there's the Volvo. And yay, we get to do the Sweden Club in season play. Hooray! Limited Swedish cars, like, so, yeah. Volvo and Saab, basically. Jeez, how long has it been since I've done a fucking series in season play? I don't even remember, but there we go. So we have four races to do here. Let's get my back of my sob. Oh boy, the first race is at Catalonia School. Fan fucking tastic. Here's the uh, driver lineup. So let's go to Catalonia for our first race. This ought to be a wonderful, joyous adventure of joy. I don't even know. So, yeah, IKEA club. You have to build the tracks first. Yes, clearly. Best club ever. Ten out of ten. Where is Sebi? All right, here we go. It's all loaded up. So let's take a look at the starting grid. I'm starting third. Okay. I should have I should have used the uh, Volvo C30 to have an even grid, but oh well. Oh well, that is true. Best club is the Bagel Club. So you're the stupid idiot around here, fucker. I don't know. So, anyways, let's go. Let's race. It's been a few days, so it'll be fun. Epic four-wheel drive launch. Always the epic four-wheel drive launch. Always. Alright, Rossi. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, alright, Rossi, how much of a pain in the ass are you gonna be? But then Muller is here. Damn it, Muller. Get out of my way. Pokemon Go is taking over the world, not just people's lives. It's taking over the world. As expected. Like, I knew, I knew it was going to be a massive fucking thing. When it came out, and now it's out, it's a massive fucking thing. Called it. Oh, it's not available in Europe. Okay, it's taking over parts of the world more. There. Maybe not the entire world, but eh. I don't know. Overall, I think it's probably going to be end up being a very, very... It, it's it's going to... I don't know what I'm saying. It's simultaneously a good and bad thing. 
good because, you know, people are active and meeting people and doing cool things and stuff. And then the bad thing is all the shitty people are um, using it to their advantage to uh, do bad things to other people. God, yeah, the fucking Sasha Banks thing. There's a Jigglypuff in the ring. That was great. I don't know. I, I installed it... Like, while I was sitting in my room, got a Charmander, I think I got a fucking Weedle that was kind of chilling outside my house, and then I uninstalled it because I stopped caring. So, I don't know. It's just, I don't know, it's just mobile games don't interest me, ever. That's the one I had, like, the most interest in, and I still have no interest in it. So, I'm basically out of the loop, and I'll forever be out of the loop, because I'm a shitty nerd. Shitty hipster nerd. Yeah, make people go outside to play a game, those bastards, how dare. How dare. Oh, we are going wide. We are going very wide. Holy shit. Okay. So this looks like this won't be too bad of a series. In fact, I might have made it a little too easy on myself. I don't know. Maybe I'll put the stock tires back on. Parents are talking in the hallway, which means you probably can hear every single word they're saying because they have no inside voice. Hooray! I love everything. Yeah, meanwhile, Pokemon Sun and Moon. That's, that's the Pokemon games I'm actually interested in. Is this for a Let's Play? Yes, it is. But yeah, Sun and Moon I'm actually really looking forward to. I remember the Pokewalker. I have two of those because I have both Heart Gold and Soul Silver. I think I've kind of used my Pokewalker once just to see what the fuck it did. Not much else. So hey, I won easily. Hooray! Yeah, I think I'm gonna take the. Uh, I'm gonna put the stock tires back on this thing. Once uh, the other sobs get across the line here, Weber not with, or excluding Weber because he's already across the line. There we go. Spears in last again. What a fucking shocker. Okay, well, race one done. Cars level one. Big surprise. Oh my god. Oh my god. Who liked a tweet? Oh. Uh. Random shitter liked my stream tweet, okay. Probably like, please look at me, I'm desperate. Alright, so... Looks like I'm gonna have to go all... Whoops, I went too far back through the menus. Okay, upgrade shop. Tire compound. I went too fast, now it's taking this sweet time. Okay, there we go. Back to the stock tires. Man, that took like 18 PI off the car. Damn. Yes, this is Swedish uh, series. Go, man. Okay, anyways, next race. Taking place at Maple Valley Short. Alright, let's go. I wonder where I'm going to start now. If I'm going to start fourth or still in third. Not sure. Here, obviously, he's one dirty son of a bitch. No. He's just fast. Not really a dirty son of a bitch. I know when we talk about Rossi, we kind of exaggerate. Because it's M fucking Rossi, but you know. Yeah, 18 PI for fucking tires. It's like, oh, well then. 
So where am I going to start? Yep, fourth place. Thought so. Okay, let's try that again. Um, this time, we now know that if Miller goes to the inside of me, on the left-handers, he's going to stay there. Unlike what I was expecting him to do, aka, uh, back the fuck off. So now we have that little nugget of knowledge. Oh, since was hitting run was GTA. Road Rage was crazy ta- okay. I got my Simpsons games mixed up because I don't know anything about them. Nah. There we go, much better. Hello, Rossi, how you doing? Goodbye. That was easy. Only event that people drive dirties, NASCAR, and bump and runs. Um, have you seen touring, like, British touring car racing, Garber? Even, uh, Australian V8 supercars. They like to, uh... Get a little rough. Also, I slowed way the fuck down. I, I just completely forgot or didn't realize how slow I was going. Go me. Fucking incredible. Excuse me. Yeah, have you seen Rossberg versus Hamilton? Uh, good old Rossberg versus Hamilton. I did actually watch this past uh, British Grand Prix yesterday. Because I was up at 7 a.m. because of my, you know, internal alarm. Not really. But, um, anyways, fucking. Yeah, I was up and I'm like, yeah, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna watch the British Grand Prix. And that's the second of two live races I've watched this year that started under safety car. Go me. I'm amazing. Also, turn one was hell in that race. Because right on the turn in, it had the, t the most narrowest of dry lines, so if you fucking even was like a millimeter off, you were going off, and a lot of people did, including Hamilton. Oh, the save of the race was fucking Sergio Perez, because he was, he, he, uh, he fucked up turn one. His car was at a 90 degree angle, like, it had... He had no business saving that at all, and he saved it. Yeah, fucking Max Verstappen. Podium! The fuck is even bumping runs, Garber? Are you talking about, like, bumper cars or some shit? Because when I, when I read bump and runs, I read it as, like, an actual tactic in racing, not a form of it. Please enlighten me. Who won? Hamilton. Lol, Hamilton wins. I mean, he dominated that fucking race. He was untouchable. It was basically a battle for second between Rosberg and, uh... Verstappen. And then there's, like, the 3-4-5 way battle for, like, the last couple points throughout the entire race, which was pretty exciting. It's like, oh, demo derby racing, okay. I see what you mean. Should have just called it Derby Racing, jeez. I don't know. Oh god, okay. We're good, everything's fine. Everything's A-OK. -okay. Yeah, Hamilton will probably end up winning the season again. Unless... Whatever slump that Rosberg has found himself into fucking, like, fixing fixes itself and he starts doing what he did at the beginning of the season. Yes, I've played the Midnight Club series before. I played the first three games. I have not played LA yet, despite owning it for pretty much since release. 
but I've never actually like played it other than for 10 minutes. Go me. Go me. Going to victory lane is me. Hooray! And now we wait on Johansson and Spears. And then my controller disconnects for a split second. Okie dokie. Cool. And we have a tie for the point lead between, or for second in points between Muller and Rossi. Oh, hey, Muller got around Rossi. I hmm, wonder when the hell that happened in the race. Because I wasn't paying attention. Okay, well, we got two ties in the points after two races. GG. So. Yeah, two. Ow. Shoulder. Two down, two to go. In the Sweden Club. So, where are we going to go next? Let's just skip this scene here. We don't need to see these days advance slowly. Oh, Camino Viejo. Alright. I am perfectly fine with that, so. To Camino Viejo for three laps. Heck yeah. Hey, Denny. I've got nothing. Don't mind me. Hello, Bigfoot. Stop with your goddamn Spanish. Motherfucker. This is an English only chat? Because I am racist. No, I'm not. I don't, I don't fucking know. Anyways, let's go. At Camino Viejo. Viejo. Saab versus Volvo. In car. It's a nice vlog I did. Eh. I thought it was shit because well, I think everything I do is shit and I'm also a camera shy asshole. I was very, very reluctant to uh, add that clip of me singing in the car. Cause I'm just like, I look stupid. Oh my god. Doesn't have enough power to accelerate up the hill. Come on, Rossi. It's only a matter of time before I get around you. You, you should know this by now, son. I think everything I do is shit. Should do more vlogs. Well, I plan on doing them for like ev when I go to events. So, yeah. That was kind of the whole reason I even did it. Because it's like, hey, I want to... I want to be able to remember these things, so I'm going to fucking be a... Sh shitter and do Eben vlogs which I've actually said in the past that I would don't have interest in ever doing well I guess uh, I'm a hypocrite also I should have expected Rossi to not give me room there I still went for it like the dumbass I am oh my god please car go Put a huge dent in Rossi's fucking back passenger door. Vlog at a car 
carnival. Uh, no, because I don't give a shit about carnivals. Oh shit, I have a couple things planned for this month. One of those I'm definitely doing. The other one I hope does not fall through, whether it be just lack of communication or work. Uh, real racing. You get me into a race car, I'll vlog the shit out of it, but right now I do not have the funds, nor the support, nor the knowledge, nor anything to do any real racing. Unfortunately. If you can get me in a race car, sign me up. If not, well, that ain't ever gonna happen, probably. Anyways, I win. Won the race after some argy-bargy with Rossi. Good old argy-bargy. I have no idea why I said it like that. <sighs> I'm not going to reveal, like, what I'm going to do until the time comes. So hush you guys. Let's turn it into Let's Play Suggestions all over again. Help me. Help. Hey, Chris. So yeah. Anyways, final race of the Swedish club, aka Saab versus Volvo. Going to Iberia in the full circuit. All right. Ooh, reverse. Oh boy. Yeah, I I called it Mueller. It's like oh, okay, I'm gonna do this one thing. Then everybody's like, shoot it like this, 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 and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Shut the fuck up. And stuff. Oh God, K boys. SJW vlog. I would watch that. <laughs> just imagine you just walking around, looking all like filming these posters and just saying, It's time to stop. Uh, that'd be great. Anyways, time to finish the series. Hooray! Sweet. All right, so here we go. Time to close out yet another championship in Forza Motorsport 3. You know, another one out of the very many, very, very many. Can I get around Rossi through turn one here? Taking a very deep line, roughing them up a little bit. And clear. Ah oh, yes, let the quotes commence. That's another thing that's gonna happen. The endless quoting. Uh-oh. Oh shit. Too fast. God, okay. We. Oui. There we go. One down, three to go. Treyarch is live on Facebook. What the fuck are they doing? They're not making the new Kawo Dawawa. I don't know, Muller. I might buy a wrestling game to experiment with the thing. I haven't decided yet. Like, it's just another, it's one, another one of those crazy ideas I have that, like, I see the finished product in my mind, but I have no idea how to actually, like, make it happen. Really really don't.
Okay, that was a much smoother lap. And it was even a clean lap. Check that shit out. I have a two and a half second advantage over Rossi. Well, damn. Two OP. Yeah, crazy ideas from crazy Rhino. Shut up. Shut up, Miller. Remember that steel chair from work? It's got your name on it. If any word made a game that's meant to be in the garbage. Alright, the game isn't even out yet, Garber. Let's not jump to conclusions. Don't be a fucking moronic piece of shit. Who knows, the game could turn out to actually be good. I mean, the COD fags will hate it because, you know, it's different, but hey, there's that chance it could actually be good. <laughs> Don't have an extreme rules match to be DQ'd. Okay. Who said this was going to be a traditional match, Miller? Hmm. I don't know. Anyways. Just kind of cruising around here. Don't mind me. Cruising USA. Except I'm racing in Spain currently. So, uh, oops. Cruising España. And win. I over-upgraded my car, kind of, I guess. I don't even know anymore. I mean, my PI was fucking 50 lower. <coughs> I just don't know anymore. One by like four seconds over Moore, who passed Rossi, which means they tied in points. They tied in points. It's like Moore gets the tiebreaker, though. Hey, Spears actually scored a point. He didn't get shut out. Oh shit, Muller's coming out with the hotkey stick. Try me, fam. I have connections. You don't want to meet Janice, do you? Yeah, I know how many dislikes the Infinite Warfare trailer has. That doesn't automatically mean the game is shit, though. Hey, I got loads of money. I'm at 400,000 again. Yay! So finally, we can move on to the next round of the R3 Championship. It's been a while since we did that. Which car was I using? Oh yeah, this one. So, um... We'll get on to that in the next segment. So... I don't know why the fuck I changed cars. I, gotta, I, I always end the segment by doing this thing or her. So anyways... R3, round 3, next segment. Stay tuned for more. Forza 3, 3, 3, 3.